Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel for baking. Now last time I showed you how to make this puff cake. Now if you can remember that from last tutorial that we did. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make the chocolate frosted muffins. First of all. We're going to start doing is to combine the flour. This is one teaspoon of baking powder, 225 grams of gas of sugar, a pinch of salt. And then add 450 grams of plain flour, this is going into a large mixing bowl. This one I'm going to receive. Then what you have to do is to save all the dry ingredients in the sieve first. And once you've saved it all, you just want to combine the, all of it together. This is a large mixing bowl, so combine it all in a large mixing bowl. Once your mixture is all combined together, then next we will do is to whisk all the wet ingredients together. So I've got 75 grams of melted butter and then I've got vanilla extract and it says a teaspoon And I've got two eggs. Just keep these eggs a crack. And 
and then some natural yogurt which is 125 milliliters what we'll do is so we score the wet ingredients together until it is smooth Once the wet ingredients have been smooth, you're just going to put these along with the dry ingredients. Go put it, pour it in, all of it in the, the same ingredient bowl as the dry ingredients are. Then, once you put all the wet ingredients in the, into the dry, what you have to do is mix it together until it is combined. And combined, what we mean is the muffin mixture. The mixture will be worked along with the all mixtures until it looks like a muffin mixture. With this, you can place them on the muffin cases. So, morphine mixtures can go into the morphine cases. So it makes 12 of them. It should be equal to all the big mixtures that I said. It has to be spooned equally to all of the muffin mixtures that, that I said. These are the muffin mixtures that I'll pour up as 12 muffins. Now I preheated the oven to 190 degrees. You're going to put it in for 15 to 18 minutes until the skewer comes out clean. So pause the video now down. I'm going to be showing you what to do next.
Now these type of muffins have been done and cooked in the oven. Now we're going to have 200 grams of milk chocolate or dark chocolate, whichever is meltable. What we need to do now is to heat the chocolate with the simmering water, a pan of simmering water, so I can let this chocolate melt everything together into a melting chocolate that will go on top of the muffins. The chocolate should be melted like this in the simmering hot water in a pan. Once your melted chocolate is smooth, now you just gonna put it on top of the muffins. So I'm showing you how to melt the chocolate and ice tea muffins. Now, to top it off and finish them off, just add 3 grams each of chocolate chips on top of the, of the, the topping. To each muffin, add three grams of each of chocolate chips on top of the muffins. So if you have chocolate sprinkles, go ahead and do so if you have any. These are the muffins I made as a tutorial and topped with chocolate chips and melted chocolate. Now if you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more recipe tutorials and other things. So comment down what you what your what your recipe suggestions is going to be. Until then, bye.